what is Kabbalah. If you want to understand spirituality, how to connect with God, and how to create and manifest your dreams, you need to learn about Kabbalah first. All right, but what that means? It means that it's the manual of the soul. It teaches about the spiritual laws of the universe and how they govern our lives. There are a total of 12, but the most famous of them are law of cause and effect and law of vibration. But listen, if you understand how they work and learn them to your advantage, you will have the power to create anything that you want in your life. Money, love, success, friendships, whatever you want. But you are probably asking yourself like, how I'm gonna understand this? Studying Kabbalah. Because studying Kabbalah, it's studying your soul. And what is your soul? Well, it's your connection with God and universe and light whatever all these names means the same thing the thing that it created everything that you know everything that you can touch you can see uh, anything that you can smell you know the people this thing creates everything that we have in our world don't worry if you don't like to call this thing that creates everything god you can call energy if you want, you can call universe, you can call light. Doesn't have a right name for that. You know, you need to find a name that you can connect and have faith on this thing. Well, and how Kabbalah is linked to this? Kabbalah believes that, first thing, they don't call God, God. They call God, light. Because they just don't agree with the things that we, like, humans believe what it is called like god it's a man that it's in the sky judging people some people don't believe in that but kabbalah doesn't believe in this so they call it light and they talk a lot about the another world which is the spiritual world and there we humans are called um soul but container so the light has just one goal that it's share everything that she has liked she i think it is but the goal is like share everything that she has with the container the light has uh infinite blessings infinite love infinite peace so the goal is share all these good things with us with the container container is like just one term that kabbalah used for talk about us all right guys you are probably so confused about kabbalah and about all these terms and about spiritual like what is this i know because i had the same thoughts when i study i start to study kabbalah but don't worry i will make more videos and i promise it will be more easier to understand all right so everything that i'm saying came from a book that it's called zohar it's like kabbalah book and explain what has behind the world that we live in and like what's yeah what is our purpose here and what we are doing here and how we were created like how all these things happen you know everything that we don't understand the Zohar helps us to understand so the Zohar explains that it was our soul that decide to leave the spiritual plane to live here why this happened so you remember that I told you that the light always share everything with the container, right? With us, but like in the spiritual plane. So the thing is, the container wants to share with the light too, but the light just give. Uh, the light doesn't receive. So the container asks the light, like, I want another plane. I want another world that I can do everything that you do because I want to be like you. So the light says like, okay i will create another world for you be like me light says okay i will give you another world but i can't be in this world so she just left the spirit world and after the light left the container started to do this like with all the souls and boom big bang basically that's what kabbalah says about how we were created but you know you can still believe in god you can still believe in whatever you believe you know i'm just sharing with you another options another things 
you know, you don't need to believe in everything that I'm telling you if you don't want. You have this choice. But uh, everything that Kabbalah says, I really believe. And also, like, continue what I was saying about the light. It is the light, it's still with us. The light decides to left the spiritual world, but the light, it's still with us. It's with our soul. So our purpose here is to make this light shine, you know, and how we are going to do this, sharing, being like the light. This is what Kabbalah thinks. This is what Kabbalah believes. If we want to receive blessings, love, peace, we need to be like the light because that's what our soul wanted. So if you want to receive you need to share first. You need to be the light. Remember what the light did, the light share with the container. So you need to share with the people everything that you know, everything that you have with you. And this is gonna make you receive all the good things from God, from universe. So be like the light and you're gonna receive everything that you want.